you are on Hey Team Marie on my new auntie show. Hey everyone, it's AJ Marie, and first off, I'm showing you the products that I use to get this perm rod set. I use some soft deep protein styling gel, some olive oil foam wrap, um, an afro pick, and some perm rods. And I'm using the mousse and I'm putting it on my hair. I'm also going to put a little bit of gel on it. I didn't have any eco styler, and when I went to the store, that's all they had. So this is my first time using this product. Once I comb it out, I'm, look, this is my first time, y'all. It wasn't the best. It was very stressful and challenging, and here I am. This is not, I learned a little trick. This is not the trick, but I'm just showing you all how many times it takes, because I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take it out, and I'm going to try again. Um... Again, this is my first time trying it, so I'm, I'm. This is trial and error at this point. I did watch a few videos, but I couldn't get the wrist motion. And even doing just like that, where I rolled it up like a roller, I felt like that was a drop curl look that I really wasn't trying to go for. And that's what it was kind of loose, but I just kept it in. I do eventually end up doing it over. But Here's where I finally figure it out. What's that? I think six, seven, six in. So I'm putting the mousse on and then I'm putting the gel and I'm gonna comb it out. I know there's a lot of uh, mousse on my hands. I know. I've already struggled. I don't, I don't, I know. So I'm wrapping it around twice and then I'm still doing it wrong. I don't understand how frustrated I was. I was like, dang, I have so many more to go. In total, I think I ended up using thirty-six, maybe, because I have four packs. I didn't use one pack completely, and I think I had a few left over. So I'm wrapping it around, and then I'm going. Nope. I'm gonna wrap it around the bottom like so and then I'm just gonna use one hand to twirl it around it's one hand and it, it worked that way and I know you can't really see that so I'll show you again but I really just uh, flicked my wrist <laughs> flick of the wrist and I really flick I don't know look I'm tired so combing it out I'm, I'm gonna wrap the bottom around then you do want this to be wet almost soaking wet look that's one twirl two twirls and i'm gonna try for a third nope i'm just gonna put it closer to my scalp and i'll show you i believe one more time let's hope for it oh gosh it got to the left side and the left side just <sighs> the left side guy and i don't know i i don't know what it is about it but I'm still doing the twirl and you have to remember to keep the hair going upward I'll show you one more time and this is on the left side but I'm gonna wrap the bottom around once I do that I'm gonna do one immediate turn I found that um, using my finger to hold the hair helps me in some way so maybe that could be something that you incorporate into your routine but it looks like it only took me about two or three turns or twists and that um spray some water since it got a little dry I think that's water and conditioner honestly I just picked up a random bottle it's probably conditioner though or leave-in wrap the ends around use your fingers to hold the hair or whatever and wrap it spiral going upward that's pretty much it Again, it's better be 
you the best hairstyle I have, the best style that I have ever had. Like that, like, that's it. If not, me and these rods won't square up. That's it. Like, that is it. Y'all hear me? On my head, do y'all hear me? This is the next morning, and I removed the bottom part. I unfasten it, and then I literally just, it comes right off. So I'm just taking them all out now. My hair is actually very soft at this point. I don't, I mean, my hair is soft, but I, I guess, I don't know, y'all. It was very soft, if I can tell you. It feels kind of like a blowout. I did sit under the dryer for an hour, and then I slept for the rest of the couple of hours. I did not want anything else messing this thing up other than just me. So I sometimes have that issue with it not being dry. So I sat in the dry for an hour and I sprayed to heat the second round before then. But in terms of separating, I'm really just running my fingers through them and then and, and making a little curl with my finger at the end. <laughs> my pick and try to give myself some volume because this is not what I was thinking I don't know again this is my first time trying so we'll see I'm gonna show you that's about how far it is that I'm picking out I do want to keep the curls intact and just fluff up those roots I did use some bobby pins to try to give it some shape and to allow it to fall into my face and now I'll just fluff it out some more, pick it out, and try to play with it to get it to what I want it to look like. sure to like comment and subscribe and stop by for more videos i will see you next sunday <laughs>